Hey guys, what is up? I have another Dharma video for you guys today. So before I start this video, I'm just going to give you a heads up. Tomorrow and Thursday, Dharma Man is also going to release a video around 8 o'clock Eastern Time. I'm not going to be, I'm going to be at work those two nights. So those two videos, Wednesday and Thursday's videos, are going to come out Friday evening, most likely, Friday night. So just a heads up, that's when my videos are coming for tomorrow and the next day. But this video is going to be called Sister Calls a Brother's Girl, a Gold Digger, She Instantly Regrets It. So... Some free thoughts. If a sister has a reason to believe that the brother's girlfriend is a gold digger, well then why can't she say it? You know what I mean? If she's just being stupid, assuming that she is with no proof or evidence, she's just stupid. That's just someone just being stupid, right? So I guess we'll see. It's about 11 and a half minutes long, so it's not like too short, but it's not like crazy long either. So I guess we shall see what happens. Let's go, guys. This should be good, though. Hey, are you okay? Your hand is sweaty. <sighs> I'm just so nervous. Why? What if your sister doesn't like me? Mm. Not everyone understands our age difference. Stop. She's gonna like you, okay? As soon as she sees how much we love each other. She's probably understand. 40, she's probably 20, so it's probably definitely 20 years or so. Hey, Maggie, over here! 20, 20 years or so, I would think. 20 or so years, I think. Am I wrong? I'm so sorry, I'm late. Am I not wrong? No, no worries. No. <laughs> Excuse me. So I said I wanted to introduce you to someone special. Hi, I'm Gail. I've heard so many great things about you. Thanks. <laughs> I uh, didn't realize your new girlfriend had a daughter. This she is my cousin. This is her. The woman who This is their girlfriend. You're telling me that this is your new girlfriend? She's not impressed. Sam, she's half your age. Well, I mean, yeah, maybe, but none of that even matters. The only thing that matters is that I love her. She loves me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sam, don't be such a fool. You really think a 20-year-old wants to be with you because of love? I'm 25, actually, and why else would I be with him? Clearly for his money, honey. Maggie, why would you say something like there that? There it is. Her? You don't even know her. I don't need to know her. Yes, you Young do. women go after older men only for one thing. And it certainly isn't love. Well, it's not all, you know, once you really again. You shouldn't judge someone before you get to know them. You know, she's right. And for the record, she didn't come after me. It was mutual. Oh, so that doesn't change anything. I can't believe you're being so naive to make her your girlfriend. Gail's not my girlfriend. Oh. Well, thank goodness. At least you got a little bit of sense. <laughs> She's my fiance. I'm his fiance. Oh my god. Oh damn. Please. Oh somebody damn. tell me this is a sick joke. Nope. They gotta tell the whole restaurant. No joke. I proposed last week. Sam, why would you do that? Jeez, you're making a scene I can't of believe home. you're so blind. Oh, hello, ma'am. Can I get you? <laughs> She's like, okay, relax. Oh my gosh, yes. Can you give me a drink? Give me a dirty martini with extra gin. Sure, right away. Would either of you like anything else? If she asks for a cocktail, I think you should check her ID. Who knows? She might be underage. Would you like a drink? Uh, no, I'm fine. Thank you. I'm okay. Thank you. She definitely looks over 18, if you ask me, but, like, she's really pretty. Look, I get that this is hard Look for most people to understand. But I promise I'm not interested in Sam's money. <laughs> sure you aren't. And the sky isn't blue. Maggie, give her a chance, please. All right, well, a couple minutes into this video and I kind of have some thoughts. So, like, it depends. Like, if you're into younger, like, I, like, some people are, are just into younger. Like, I'm 21. I don't necessarily peop like people that are like much older than me. I actually kind of prefer my age or even a little bit younger, like maybe like 19, 20 ish, maybe even 18. I'm, I'm 21, so it's not, that's not bad, right? So, like, <clears throat> I'm kind of into a bit younger as well. Not like crazy young, obviously, just like a, a couple years, but um, the thing is, it's like, I don't know. Like, to, just because she, like, like, I guess you can kind of like have an assumption or kind of like maybe have a thought that like maybe she's in it for the money because maybe sometimes they are like to be honest sometimes they are but the thing is to, to just assume like yes like you are in it for the money like you definitely are in it for the money it's like sorry no, what'd you say what 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 no it's not true bitch like you know what I mean it's like don't assume 
It could be different, like, you know, everybody's different. You could like someone to fill the money, you could not like someone to fill the money. Like, it, it, it all just depends, you know, like, don't assume. Uh, this is another video that, that, that's gonna say, do not judge before you get to know somebody because you never know. Like, you just see her and you see, like, I will admit, it is kind of like weird to see someone like 20 years older, but it's like, if you guys love each other, I don't care, it's not my business. If, if, if I see someone that's like 60 and 30, I'll be like, okay, that's a little odd, but if you guys love each other and you guys are all for that, then okay, like, I don't care. It's not, it's, it's not about business. Is it affecting me? No. Why do I care about it? If you guys are happy, you guys are happy. That's what matters, right? Like, I guess, I guess that's the sister, but like, either way, it doesn't really affect her. It's not really affecting her in any sense, to be honest. Like, it's not really gonna, like, unless, of course, she is in it for the money, then, of course, it would affect him, which could affect her. You know what I mean? Like, you know, because it's family, if your family gets hurt, like, you kind of hurt, like, with them, right? But, like, you get what I mean. I just don't want to show why people are like this sometimes. Like, don't assume, wait till you get to know the person. And then again, this video is called She Instantly Regrets It. So let's see what happens. But let's go. Let's, let's go, guys. I know no, that if you would just, just get to know her. Like, for all we know, she's richer than him. Maybe she doesn't need any money at all. Like, for all we know, she has more money than him. In love with her, Sam. Just because she's... Lust with her, and there's a difference. I wouldn't have proposed if that was the case. True. Yeah, I wouldn't have proposed just for lust. this way about me. Neither have I. <laughs> okay. Well, let me ask you this. If you ever got sick, do you think she would stick by your side? She probably would want you to pass so she can take your money. Oh my god. No, that she would stick by my side. Against loyal. But that brings us to the real reason why I invited you here today. I am finalizing my will. And I would like for you to be a witness. So will 100% of you are leaving 100% of everything you have to her? Oh shit! Yes, I am. Thought long. About are you insane, Sam? You're giving her two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. But that is a lot of money. I would admit that is You're a lot of money. You up to this, didn't you? No, I insisted that he didn't give me anything because I knew the problems it would cause. Yeah, right. Sam, she is playing you. Here we go again. I can't let you do this. <laughs> I'm old enough to make my own decisions, okay? Is, it, is he sick? You don't want to sign it. That's fine. I'll find somebody else. But I really prefer it if it were you. Fine. If you want to give everything you have to a gold digger, then so be it. No, oh, just you wait. Again, like, why do you care? It's not going to affect you, is it? Like, your family, yes, but it's only going to affect you. But I'm telling you, this is the biggest mistake of your life. No, Maggie. See, that's where you're wrong. <laughs> he, he's going to get sick or something. Sam. Are you alright? Here, drink some of this. Oh, please, don't act like you care. Look, I am not as easy to fool as my brother. You just care about the money. Like, how, like, have I even you asked him for money? Stop. You need to apologize. I don't need to do anything. One martini, extra gin for you, and I'll leave the check right here. Thank you, I'll take that. Of course you will. She probably doesn't pay for anything. She pays all the time, Maggie. You know what? See, she probably has more money than him. I just can't sit through this anymore. This is painful. <sighs> One day, when you get really sick, she's going to leave you all by yourself. I, I love how she says when you get sick, as if like she just knows she he will. Don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, well, that went terrible. Her biggest I fears came true, basically. She didn't act like that. It's fine. I knew that was gonna happen. Not everyone understands our age difference. Yeah, you're right. But soon she's gonna realize that. <laughs> oh, Sam, are you alright? You've been coughing a lot lately. We need to get this checked out. See, she cares. She is really. Are you Gail? He, he is sick, yes. isn't he? How's Sam doing? Not very good, unfortunately. 
Do you want to come with me? Does he have cancer? Turns out Sam has late stage cancer. <sighs> Honestly, I'm amazed that he hasn't been in here sooner. What? That can't be. We had to put him in an induced coma. And the only way he could come out was this is Sam. Doctor, is my brother going to be okay? Well, I was just explaining to Gail, the only chance he has now is if we operate on him immediately. Okay. But even so, it, it is a slim chance. We have to do whatever it takes. Actually, we took a look at the wheel, and since he is in a coma, Gail's the one that's going to have to make that call. Of course. I don't want to lose Sam. Girl's gonna, the girl's gonna pay for it. I am so sorry. Um, it looks like Sam's gonna have to come out of pocket. Two hundred and forty-nine thousand five hundred. That's fine. I have signing authority. But that's all the cash that Sam has. That means you won't get anything. Yeah, she doesn't care about that. I do have to say that it's a 10-15% chance at best that he will survive. So you may want to think about it. I don't need to think about it. Sam. Even if there was a 1% chance, I would still do it. All right, then. We'll get started immediately. Okay. Nurse, can you prepare the team and I'll get the operating room ready? I'm surprised I'm not crying yet. I did not expect this at all. Holy crap. Diamond is catching me right in my feels right now. What the oh, this must be awkward. Actually, I don't need to. Sam can tell you himself. Sam! Oh my gosh, I was so worried about you. Ow, ow. Oh, oh. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. It's I'm just okay. glad you're doing okay. Yeah, me too. <laughs> and you, thank you for making me come to the hospital. Doc said if I would have got here any later, I wouldn't have made it. Of course. I'm just so glad you're okay. So much. I love you too. <laughs> Sam, um, I don't know if the doctor told you, but we had to use the rest of the cash to pay for the surgery. It's okay. I understand. So, Gail, are you sure you want to stay with Sam? What are you talking about? Well, he just doesn't have any money left. So. That, that's okay, not why I'm here. I told you that's not why I'm here. Credit card and receipt for the cost of the surgery. Thank you. What? Her credit card. Oh. I'm sorry, I'm confused. Oh, her credit card. Oh, snap. I didn't use Sam's money to pay for the surgery. I used my own. You see? Gail owns a tech company. She has way more money than me. Told you. That's what I've been trying to tell. Told you in the beginning. So you really weren't with Sam because of his money? No. I'm so sorry. It's okay. I just hope you know. I never should have judged you before getting to know you. I see that now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. But more importantly, just how much I love Sam. Oh, babe. I love you too. <laughs> well, come on. Bring it in. <laughs> if it isn't my suit. Holy crap. Okay. That was, that was a good one. Honestly, I did not expect what I saw here at all. I expected this to be something of a kind of, kind of like more about, which obviously was about money, but I did not expect it to kind of like be more in my feels. I did not expect that whatsoever. I'm not going to lie at all. Did not expect that at all. Right now, I'm just not in a crying mood, which is why I didn't cry. But like, if I'm in a crying mood, I would have cried. Guaranteed. Um, honestly, I don't even know what to say to that. Just because like, that would... I mean, obviously the uh, the sister was wrong. Clearly, she used her own money to pay for it. She uh, she didn't care about Sam's money at all. She wanted it, or she wanted like she has her own. She doesn't care about his money. She loved him for him. 
So again, do not judge someone before you get to know them, because you could be really wrong, and she was really, really wrong. Wow. I, 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 I'm still shook at how that took a turn. I'm, I'm really glad he's okay, even though it's just a video, but I'm really glad he, uh, he's okay. So I'm definitely really happy to hear that. But it's weird how she was like, when you get really sick, and then like two days later, I'm really sick. My camera's about to die, so give me a second. Alright, sorry guys, my camera's about to die. Um, but yeah, honestly, do not assume. Just wait, like, get to know the person. Like, the the first thing, like, again, I don't even know how, I don't even know what the age difference was, but I would assume he's like 40 to 50, and she's, what, 25? So again, it definitely can be for the money. Like, I'm not gonna lie, a lot of people are, a lot of girls are gold diggers, not gonna lie. A lot of girls are gold diggers. They just are. So... It definitely could be a possibility. Like, you know, I'm not going to say it's impossible. The thing is when people assume and just say right away, uh, you're a gold digger. Guaranteed you're a gold digger. Excuse me? Like, where'd you get this information from? Like, how do you know I don't love him? <clears throat> I just wish that people would actually ask and, like, wait to see who somebody is first before just assuming. Because assumptions got you into big trouble. So that's what you gotta look out for because, like, it's okay to have, like, a thought. Like, is she a gold digger? Okay, you know, like, she might be, but let's see. You know what I mean? Like, wait first. Don't just assume. Don't just guarantee that it's true. Don't be like, yep, it's true, it's true. Like, she had more money than him this whole time and she was still with him. Like, she doesn't care about the money. Obviously, she didn't know that, but there you go. She instantly like, regretted it. That was a really good ending. Like, she literally paid $200,500 for him just to keep him alive for a 10 to 15 percent chance that's love right there that's love right there so honestly that girl fucked up the uh, the sister fucked up big time wow i cannot wait to see reactions to this one holy crap i cannot wait to see reaction this one to, this was such a good video um but yeah love is love it doesn't it doesn't matter the age now Age does matter in obviously some situations. Like if you're 10 and you're dating someone who's like 25, you know, like some age some age gaps are obviously something to be concerned about. If they're all over 18, then we're good. <laughs> I mean, if you're like 18 and you're with someone that's like 80, which I'll probably or like 60 or 50, then it's kind of like eh, you would probably assume they're a gold digger if if the if, if the girl's 18. But you know, don't, don't assume. Love is love. A 90 Day Fiance, I don't even know if that's real, but there was like a 60 year old and a 30 year old, Samit and some other girl, but they apparently loved each other. So, love is love. 30 year difference, love is love. You love who you love, you love what you love, you, you, you love what you love. That's all I gotta say. Age is, age is just a number in most situations. Again, not, not to say for everything, because you know, there's obviously situations where, you know, it's not legal, but you know, love is love for the most part, <laughs> and usually it's fine. Don't assume, that's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna leave it at that, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you are new. Be sure to comment down below anything you guys saw this video. Please let me know your comments, because I'm or thoughts, because I know your guys are gonna have probably interesting comments on this one. Do not forget to hit the like button, and do not forget to turn on post notifications as well. And I will see you guys Friday evening with two new John Minute videos that will come out tomorrow and Thursday. Now, I'm going to end this video and watch the Leafs game, so peace out, guys. Have a good day and week. Yeah, sure. Bye. <laughs>